so some leaders just say you know what just create content post it and just keep doing this simple little formula and you'll get sales because you're selling my stuff which has you know my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon and today we're going to talk about the secret to the fastest way to get massive success in 2024 seriously the fastest way you can get success in 2024 is coming up right now but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets. That's right, you can get the success that you want, that you've been promised in 2024 if you learn this secret. And it's going to mind blow you because it's not what everybody else is telling you I'm going to be honest with you with exactly what you need to get the most success you can possibly get in 2024 using you know attraction marketing personal branding and those kinds of things in social media all right so we're going to talk about that but before we do that I want to remind you if you're listening to the audio of this you're going to want to go check out the video at CIS <coughs> 464 oh no 494 <laughs> cis494.jsgagnon.com because I'll be sharing my screen and obviously giving you a lot more information than you can get from an audiobook all right so let's get right to it let's talk about what it means to have success right so obviously there's lots of levels of success right but what I'm talking about is getting those sales getting those that income that you need to be getting I mean I've been building online for since 2015 and I've gotten little bits of success here and there I've got massive success in a number of followers and things like that like you know in LinkedIn I got over 16,000 or so followers I mean you know Instagram I don't know we're 4,000 or so Facebook 6,000 or so uh Twitter 11,000 I mean I've got that success because I've been building my brand for a long time but I mean that's not really the success I'm talking about right now although leaders do talk about that as being part of your success and it's important to get those kinds of results before you can actually get those sales people to trust you and to look up to you and to like you and all those good things right you need to get some of those results before you get those sales although some leaders just say you know what just create content post it and just keep doing this simple little formula and you'll get sales because you're selling my stuff which has you know great um uh, uh word of mouth and everything and you're just going to get a commission right so that's affiliate marketing that certainly is a great way to get get results really fast but that's like anything else that has a shelf life unless the person who's who you're promoting is constantly creating new content new things and attracting new people you might run into um you know uh it might run out right but uh, but anyways I don't want to talk about that what I'm talking about is getting your success of your own doing we're talking about uh personal branding attraction marketing where you have a product that you're selling or it could be an affiliate product for you in the beginning it definitely should be an affiliate product unless you're unless you already built a product right but the idea is what is the secret to actually getting that success getting those sales you know let me uh, let me share my screen here and kind of talk about that a little bit so let's go here whoops no that's I'm getting there I'm getting there sorry about that okay so I mean share my screen there we go all right so I mean what's the secret to the fastest way to massive success in 2024 right what is it right I mean no matter what you do in online marketing if you want real success you need to be what people buy and what I mean by that is you need to be the thing that they're attracted to not your product not your service not your company just you right so number one is you have to be you right you have to be you now if you're not you 
Now that's, by the way, that's not the secret. The secret is coming up later, but this is kind of like the things you need to do no matter what you're doing, right? <coughs> you have to be you, right? Number two is, this is always super important. It doesn't matter again, like what you're doing, how you're doing it, you know, what you're selling. You have to know your avatar, right? You have to know your avatar because if you don't know your avatar you won't know how to create content or what content to create or where to find potential prospects or any of that because you won't be able to say well my avatar is 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 abc right and when we talk about the avatar we're talking about the definition of who it is that's your perfect prospect or your perfect customer right so your perfect customer would be the one that is defined as a certain you know a certain sex certain age uh, certain income level certain uh, background certain experience certain uh, past results certain um uh, whether they have children or not or what er what area they live in maybe what country they live in even you can go to very very deep details because whatever you do like say for example you were to say that your avatar lives in australia right then that narrows it down to who you can attract you might think right you might be like no my avatar lives in the u.s and they're in canada they're in, in australia they're in the united kingdom they're any place that they speak english because you know that's where everybody my thing is for everybody right and you know that's that's okay but the thing is that when you're not focused on an avatar on a specific avatar it becomes hard to create a message so say for example you would say they live in australia well then you would be talking about things that are that australians would understand i'm not australian so i don't really know what that means right but i mean uh, i'm canadian so maybe if your avatar was canadian you could say that you could use the a thing all the time <laughs> well although, although that's kind of a joke thing but it, it is true us canadians we we say a all the time just because that's <laughs> something we're used to saying i guess right but <laughs> or you could talk about snow you could talk about you know the mounties and all those things anyways those are all kind of cliches but still my point is that whenever you're posting content think of who you're talking to what do they like where are they where the <laughs> what's their experience where have they been <clears throat> you know you might say something like have you ever been to Cape Breton to somebody who's Canadian they might they would know more or less who that is unless they're in like some crazy part of Canada that's never heard of it or they're too young and they don't know their geography but you wouldn't say have you ever been to Cape Breton to most people in the US or in Australia right they would have no clue what that is or they wouldn't know where it is so you that's what I mean knowing your avatar is super important and number three is know, <coughs> know your offer now again offer I talk about that in lots of other other things um but um yeah let's just uh hold on and yeah so your offer is super important as well again it's it's to help you know what kind of content what kind of comments what kind of where you're looking for people because your offer is what you offer them what you can do for them it's not your product your service your company that's not your offer your offer is what they get out of it so it could be like even though let's say you're offering a weight loss program or weight loss supplements or being part of a weight loss company or whatever that is not your offer your offer could be getting them to finally lose that weight that they've been trying to lose for you know 20 years or getting them to have a better sleep because they're in better health and their weight is under control right uh, or being more productive because they're you know more energetic right it's not about the product it's about what they get out of it all right so that's the offer so those three things are super critical for you to know it, it, for you to do like like I said being yourself and knowing your avatar and knowing your offer <coughs> those three things are you know without a doubt with a, whether you follow this method that I'm going to talk to you about or, you know the secret or whether you don't you still need to do that because if you don't do that you'll never really get to a level where you can scale your success right because you know getting one sale two sales three sales ten sales even doesn't really 
give you success right it's not gonna like a, you know even if they're a thousand dollar sales after 10 of them it's ten thousand dollars yeah sure that's great but what if that's all you make and you know after five years you still haven't made more than that right that's not that's not success right that's not what we're talking about we're talking about massive success is insane number of sales to get you like we could be talking about a hundred thousand dollar income in a year or in six months right even that's what I'm talking about when I'm talking about massive success of course you have to have a product you have to have an offer you have to have all that defined and but if you do what the leaders are telling you to do you know you're not going to get that kind of success you you might get dozens of sales but you're not going to get that crazy income and I'm not I'm not saying I'm promising you that obviously I can't promise you anything because it all depends on all so many different things but there is one thing I can promise you and that is you will get massively massively more results following what I'm going to teach you in a minute than if you did the normal way of what everybody else is teaching right okay so that's that's my promise to you <clears throat> and when I say massive more results I'm talking 10 100 times more than you would get without it and but before I actually get into that actual activity that the secret that you need to be doing I want to talk to you about the process right no matter what you're doing so the process is pretty simple right <coughs> process to get results on social media with personal branding branding and attraction marketing okay so there's a process for that if you've been learning about attraction marketing you've been learning personal branding you've been learning about social media you kind of need to know all that stuff so there's a lot of a lot of things you need to learn right so number one uh, you need to understand the social platform right you need to understand the social platform right so if you're using Facebook you need to understand that there's groups and you need to understand that the feed how the feed works and what happens when you comment on something and what happens when you post something you need to understand the algorithm that when you're posting it doesn't mean it's going to show to everybody because you have a thousand friends that doesn't really affect much because Facebook has an algorithm and it works with reciprocity and there's all these things you need to understand right you need to know how to actually use the platform how to create a post you know like click the button to add a picture I mean those are all pretty straightforward because people learn them just using that platform right just using it but then after that there's the whole other aspect of the platform where you're you know can you 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 can send private messages to people right whether they're your friends or not you can send friend requests you can you can send them a message about their profile all these things that leaders teach you to do right commenting on things uh, sending friend requests uh, sending a message to tell them hey I saw you it looks like you like horses right I love horses too when I was third 12 I I rode a horse uh, not nothing good I had a bad experience but still I think horses are great <coughs> and I really like that horse afterwards it was a really great experience for me <coughs> sorry I mean I'm not saying you tell them the whole story there but if you get in conversation you could go into that right and that's the thing you need to understand the platform all right number two you definitely you need to know you need to know what personal branding is now this is kind of personal branding this is kind of something that the leaders teach but not necessarily that directly because usually people are like well just be yourself post about yourself and that's pretty much what they say about personal branding right and the thing about personal branding is it's not just about posting about you it's also about making sure that people know what you're about when they try to look at your profile they look at your posts they look at your comments they kind of get a feeling for who you are and what you're about and what your values are and all those things now it's not easy to do that because and plus it takes time right personal branding if you think about somebody like Eric War for example right his personal brand is all about network marketing pro right it's all about his book go pro right it's all about his events it's all about all those things but you know 20 years ago before he started all this go pro stuff and and, and network marketing pro 
he was just a guy in network marketing doing sales and being being a guy that people liked right and that's what you got to do you got to be the person that people like you got to be doing things that the people you the, your avatar your avatar has to like you it's all it's that simple if they don't like you they're gonna go on to somebody else and that's okay too they don't not everybody has to like you but if you uh, define your avatar properly and your offer properly whenever you're posting things that are kind of related to that they're gonna like you because that's who they are they like whatever you're creating because you know who they are and you're creating content for them right so that's part of personal branding right and the other thing and oh and the other thing about personal branding is you want to make sure that your profile speaks to that speaks to what you're about speaks to what you offer them and not in your product like I said again your offer is just what they can get out of it so you might talk about how you've helped people lose weight uh, or gain their energy back or spend more time with their grandkids right if you're into weight loss right and you might want to talk about those things without talking about the product or the company or anything like that just how excited you are that you know Jane or or or, or Bob lost a certain amount of weight and now he's able to run around with his grandkids right if that's your target market <clears throat> but that's the thing you need to be doing that okay so the, and also your profile has to be um letting them know what goes on in your your activities not necessarily your not necessarily your personal activities you can it's really up to you but it's not necessarily about your personal activity it's more about just your activity in life like what kind of what kinds of thing can they expect if they become you know your friend right what are, what what would you talk to them about what would you be interested in uh, about them right those kinds of things so that they can kind of figure now I'm saying like these are like these are basic things that you need to do if you want to use attraction marketing personal branding to build a brand online to become a success online those are the basics now I've been doing that like I said since 2015 so I've been doing it for a long time and I've had my ups and downs done some things wrong done some things right and and I can tell you that that is super critical to do like today if I was to reach out to almost anybody that I've been involved with they would kind of have a clue that I do programming I do websites I've had I have software I have a blog they kind of know I have all those things going on and they most of them would know that I have daughters and that I live in Canada and you know those kinds of things right but until they know that if I tried to talk to them they would be not necessarily open to talk to me right anyways that's part of the secret by the way getting them to know you before you have a conversation with them and the way you do that with what everybody teaches you is that you create content right um oh and the other thing is of course you need to understand you need to understand attract under stand attraction marketing right I'm sorry I'm looking at the keyboard because I have trouble typing without looking at it uh you need to understand attraction marketing again it's kind of the same as personal branding in the sense that it's just a process and attraction marketing just works by creating content that your avatar is interested in and making them see that content now the problem with typical attraction marketing and just the concept of creating content regularly is that you're not in control of whether that content is seen by the person who is your avatar right at Facebook will show your content based on you being interactive with other people's content it's a reciprocity thing right so Facebook will show it to more people if you're active on more other people's stuff right but the thing you never will control on Facebook at least not without the secret I'm going to tell you you'll never control who sees it out of your 10,000 or out of your 5,000 or 2,000 friends or sorry I said 10,000 but I guess 10,000 followers you could have you're not going to control who of those people will see your content it's going to be whoever Facebook thinks will react to that content so it could be people you've never even that this would be the first time they see your post right and and one of the things about attraction marketing is that it only works if people 
have seen you often enough to become attracted to you. Now, when I say attracted, I don't mean they want to marry you or they want to date you or whatever. I'm not talking about that kind of attraction, not, you know, not human physical uh, attraction. I'm talking about attraction to whatever it is that you're offering attraction to potentially buying your product right to finding out more about what you're what you're how you can help them right the attraction to you as a person so that they can get to the point where they trust you enough to buy from you when you tell them hey buy this kind of thing right that's, that's oversimplification but that's basically the process that attraction marketing is that you're not in control you're not in control of how many people see your post or how many posts a single person sees if you just use the typical methods that are taught by all the leaders out there all right so so the, if you understand that okay and the, number four of course you got to be creating content content regularly and posting it of course right and posting it so when I say that I mean obviously you don't have to be posting a piece of content every day and that could be could be uh could be well anyways I'm not gonna write it here because it's basically anything it could be once a day it could be five times a day it could be once a week once a month although once a month is not gonna really work with what I have to offer you it really would be I would say two to three times a week at least would be the the sweet spot or the minimum I should say the minimum because if you and plus if you do more than like once a day I do I don't know multiple posts I might do 10 posts in a week right it depends on the days I'll do more in some days more other days I have some automation in place I have other things which of course you could do too <coughs> but you have to have some posts that you manually post uh there's tools that'll let you manually post even though they're not because you're still posting but you're not kind of you're not in you're letting the tool help you with the scheduling and when you post and things like that because a scheduled post on Facebook when you use Facebook to schedule it won't necessarily have the same impact as a post you post mainly yourself like in directly in the app going to the the screen and clicking the image and clicking the text typing it in that's not the same thing as using the item the preparing it and then saying schedule for tomorrow right Facebook knows the difference it knows you scheduled it <laughs> so it treats you differently and it's kind of sucks but that's how it works all right so I mean uh, I got something going on over here just a second yeah so I mean you know that's the thing so you got to be creating content regularly and posting uh, now I know you're like well what's the secret what's the secret you're probably going to fast forward to this if you're watching this uh, uh this on YouTube or whatever but you can certainly go fast forward and find what the secret is but it's not going to be useful to you unless you understand the why of it right okay so number five uh you do need to be engaging you need to be engaging on other people's posts and what else you also need to you must reply to their comments Okay, so I mean that's the thing so those two things are based the basics of social media marketing right where you're posting content I guess those three things those three things number four five six there you're posting content regularly you're going on the news on Facebook you're commenting on other people's stuff you're replying to their comments on your stuff that's kind of like the the it gets the ball rolling right but what I'm talking about the secret to the fastest massive growth in 2024 I'm talking about taking you taking control of that the, the the commenting and the engaging on other people's posts I mean the commenting is fine you just you'll see people comment on your stuff you can reply to that but the actual post that you engage on so how can I make this clear so if you if you comment on posts in the newsfeed if you just go to the groups or you go to newsfeed or you go to go to your friends profiles <coughs> just by going to their to I don't know their birthday or you just look at your friends list you're randomly going to post that Facebook kind of wants you to go to right so Facebook is kind of in control of your activities 
it kind of like will show you stuff that you have uh that it thinks you're going to be interested in and it's also going to show your stuff to the people that same thing the way the other way right your posts are going to go to people that Facebook thinks are interested in them and how does Facebook how does Facebook know that you might be interested in that or how does people Facebook know that who might be interested in your content well there's a couple of things and obviously this this is part of the Facebook algorithm so there's no way to be sure plus it'll change all the time but one of the things that seems to be pretty sure is that Facebook will assume that somebody who likes something in the past will like it again more likely to like it again or comment on it right if they've done something in the past to one of your posts Facebook will probably think that that same person might be interested in it right or a person similar to them right so that's one thing that happens and then the other thing is Facebook will share your stuff with the people that you've engaged with now I'm not saying 100 percent obviously again like I said it's an algorithm it changes all the time so there's no way to know exactly but I've seen that in my experience right people will see the stuff that I'm gonna I see the comments of most I see how can I put this I see lots of familiar faces in my posts and the comments they post they are the same people are on my posts regularly right and also I see people that comment on my posts after I comment on theirs and that's a reciprocity thing the human brain or the way that people are doing things that's kind of one of the things that will happen right so here's my here's the secret the secret is the secret is understand how the human brain works that's pretty crazy right so the secret is and this is kind of like you'll I'll kind of explain it understand how the human brain works relating am I gonna uh, to attraction to to becoming becoming whoops becoming attracted to an idea so that's really important to understand because if you understand that then you can leverage it and that's what I've done obviously with a software which is what I kind of want to talk to you about <clears throat> I've done this with a software where basically because I understand how the human brain works relating to become attracted to an idea <coughs> I built a software that lets me leverage that which you can use as well of course and basically the idea here is that a, a person gets attracted to an idea if they see it enough it's really <laughs> it's really that simple right and that's probably something you're you re totally realize and where you're I'm saying this right now you'll be like duh yeah I mean that's why I bought this car because I saw the ads all the time on tv and I just thought that car was awesome or maybe I saw it in magazine all the time or on YouTube ads or whatever right because you see something often enough you become attracted to it There's, that's what marketers do that's what on that's what advertising does they know that right so if you can take advantage of that human trait you can have massive success and the reason I say that is because <clears throat> you know leaders tell you go talk to people go send friend requests send them private messages have conversations with them right and that that works but the problem is you're limited by what Facebook will allow Facebook will not allow you to message more than 10 maybe even 20 you might be able to do 20 but I'm pretty sure that if you did 20 every single day for a week or, or I don't know how long but a while <coughs> that Facebook would put you in jail because you're doing too much they consider that spam right so they're going to put you in Facebook jail which means you can't message people for like a month or six months or whatever right so that really doesn't help imagine doing that for you know for a month and you're getting you're getting out of 20 people you message you might get one in four one maybe maybe you get one in 20 message you back you have conversation with them right 
and maybe you get one or two sales in that month yay great okay well I can scale that all I have to do now is talk to 100 people a day and I'm gonna get five sales instead and it'll be awesome but you know what you won't be able to Facebook will block you way long before you can get there so that's why you can't do those things and get massive success you can get a little success but you'll also burn it out because you know if you have to talk to 20 people to get one person to talk to it's very draining you know all those no's or ignoring you or not even replying right that's really <laughs> really hard on the on our you know confidence right so but what if I was to tell you that using this method right using the software that I put together to take advantage of this this thing this trait of a human you can get 90 percent if not more of everybody you try to talk to to reply and to have a conversation with and the reason is because you don't try to talk to them until they're warmed up to you and you warm them up using the software not well it's actually not using the software you warm them up by having com having comments on their post by having them comment on your post by them seeing you in their notifications by them this whole interaction takes a while that's the thing right a human brain you know a person gets attracted to an idea they see it enough and that's the question becomes what is enough right and it depends on what it is but if it's if it's attracted to your personal brand which means your social profile with your Facebook account your Facebook posts they get attracted to those things only if they see them enough and they won't see them enough unless unless you're seen in their stuff often enough and if you try to you know po comment on every single one of their posts every single time they post something because you're going to the profile every day that's also gonna be creepy because they're gonna be like what's this person want that's on because you know <clears throat> they're gonna be like I don't even know who this is and all of a sudden they're commenting on all my stuff like the f if you and this is a thing a person is automatically suspicious of somebody doing something for them that's just how it is they're suspicious of your motives right in the beginning I actually remember doing doing what I'm doing now and I remember there was a, well, a person that uh, I, I sent him a message too early right they didn't really know who I was but I sent him a message too early he kind of replied back and forth I said hey is it okay if uh, did you want to learn about this or whatever and she replied back to me saying she doesn't want to spam people <clears throat> and I'm like what do you mean I'm not I'm not well, we had a conversation <clears throat> I don't remember what I said I probably didn't say that but I and her her you know uh perception was that I was spamming her post by commenting on a bunch of her posts and that is what they're gonna feel in the beginning so you can't comment you can't comment on five six things and then send a message you gotta wait it's gotta another concept is that human brains automatically warm up to somebody if it's been long enough that they've seen you do good things for them they're not gonna they're gonna be suspicious in the beginning so it's got to take a while that's why when I say massive success in 24 in, imagine for six months all you're doing is creating content commenting on other people's stuff and just doing the the motion right you're just doing the motion you're doing the motion for six months I know it sounds like oh my god that's insane no results for six months what are you talking about well you're gonna get some results you're gonna get people lots of engagement on your posts you're gonna get people following you maybe you can grow Instagram and other things if you want as well you can get followers all those kinds of things you can get those kinds of results and sure you could try to have sales with friends of yours the people that already know you and all that but I tell you after six months of doing this activity you following the system that I will lay out for you probably in the next episode because we're already at 33 minutes that system is going to be your savior so yeah I mean it's going to be your savior because what will happen is you're going to end up building up a list of people that will respond to you when you come message them the secret is still the same I mean the secret or the process is still the same where you must engage with people's 
uh, have conversation with people for them to buy from you you can't like at least not in the beginning when you're starting out you can't expect people to just buy from you because you post a piece of content you know even if you do ads <laughs> even if you do ads unless you have proof that what you're selling gives them the results that you're promising like other people saying so like social proof right that they call if you don't have that you're not going to make any sales or at least very very little because the only people that will buy is people that are going to be you know suspicious but still think you know it's worth the the trying it out right what you want is you want people to believe in you and so that whenever you talk to them you say you know what I have been following you for for a while and I really love your content and I just realized that I think there's something that I have that you might be interested in do you mind if we talk about it for a bit and that could be all you need to do and you know what if you have built these relationships using the software that I'm going to tell you about <clears throat> you will get those results and imagine having like a hundred people ready to have a conversation with you in six months from now right and you keep going the next month you'll have another 20 or 50 maybe 100 depends on how much how much activity you do but imagine having like 100 people like every month ready to have a conversation with you I tell you it's possible because that's what I have right now I have thousands of people ready to have conversation with me I just need to have because I'm building my own software my own product and that's the thing that I'm doing right now <clears throat> so I'm kind of getting ready to do to do the the, the actual launch and that's kind of what I'm I have I have thousands of people I, I mean I can probably show you right now if I look at this list right here let's go here these are badges by the way you can win with the software I'm gonna I'm talking to you about but if I just go <coughs> to my data here I probably should have loaded that before but um yeah let me just pause it and come back so yeah as you can see I have a lot of hot leads now this is hot leads right here this is just a list of the hot leads that I have and these are people that I've been engaging with on their posts that if I had a conversation with them with any of them right now they would all know who I am at the very least and find it great that I've been commenting on their stuff and that's what the tool tells you gets you to do now I could I have 301 here I could send a message every single one of them but that would be ridiculous because I certainly don't have time to send that many messages plus Facebook would still block me so but the thing is the difference is that if I if I do what the leaders tell you to do if I do that and I send messages to random people that don't really know who I am yet <clears throat> and I get one out of 20 people to actually have a conversation with I I have to send those 20 messages to get one conversation right whereas with this if I say I want to have like five maybe three conversations a day I can just pick any of these send a message to them tell them I have something that I think they might be interested in and ask them if they want to look at it and that's it uh, out of you know out of five probably four if not five will actually say yeah sure send it my way right I mean that's the beginning of a sales process obviously it doesn't mean everybody's going to buy but still the likelihood of them buying if it's something that really is for them right whatever it is you're selling is so so high so imagine if you had all these leads after six months you have all these leads that you can do and then you keep doing the activities that got you those leads every single month you'll have a ton more leads so that's how you're going to get super massive success in 2024 and how do you get this software well you go to activegroupusers.com and you just set up an account you can try a trial there's going to be demos there's going to be different things right now you can kind of use it in pre-launch if you want uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff if you go to the about page well that link will take you to this page here where you can kind of uh look at a little bit how it's gets used there's a little video here that kind of explains how it's used and then it uh, talks a little bit about how to use it what it does right and how to install it and everything else so that's kind of where you can get the information on that and like I said you can get those hundreds of hot leads not just people who have no clue who you are you can get people that all know who you are 
because that's really the secret of attraction marketing it's getting people to know who you are and you know five years ago it was different than today five years ago you could actually just create content and Facebook would show it to the same people over and over it would grow them in your in their knowledge of you to a point where they know and like and trust you right now that doesn't work that well so you kind of have to use a process that's very well defined and this is what this is this will get you there so fast unbelievably fast I promise you that it'll give you 10 100 times more results than if you didn't use it I know for a fact and we're gonna get lots of success stories we're gonna get those on a you know a funnel page everything else so you can go and see the social proof where you don't have to just believe me and but it's gonna happen all right so hopefully your 2024 will be massive success it's time to get in right now and let me know because prices will go up you'll tr free trials will go away that kind of stuff so you got to get in now go to activegroupusers.com and let me know when you're there this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.